on my last video of the day. I did a lot of videos this time. Woo! Van Damme and Street Fighter 2 Lionheart Edition. Let's check it out. <laughs> yeah, it was that, like that pulse and suits, you know, Ryu and... I love this fight in my heart. Yeah. Kidney shot. Funny too, when the dude stepped up to, he thought he was real tough. I remember it. He was like, kick his lying ass. <laughs> that knee is the shit. <laughs> Easy in a form with it. <laughs> and that knee too. <laughs> This was his hardest fight besides Attila. If you watch the movie, it was like, why was this third fight the hardest one? It was a long fight, too. <laughs> I used to watch this every day when I was a kid, too. This was one of my favorites. I always fast forwarded past this fight because I didn't like it. <laughs> oh, the fight it was just slow. It was Nothing really dynamic about it, except for those, those, those two kicks he hit him with. <laughs> you win. Who's next, the guy in the pool or the guy in the tennis court? Yeah. Not tennis court, with a racquetball court. <laughs> Some good shit out of it. Remind me of Jackson and Bloods of War. Ah! <laughs> man, this movie's really bringing me back, man. I ain't seen this in a long time. Here we go. <laughs> Strong. Playing the capoeira maestro, chico. You mad now? Put him in that dirty war. <laughs> I 
<laughs> this is one of the best knockouts I've ever seen in a movie, period. The best knockouts I've ever seen. And it's where they gave Johnny Cage, I bet you, that rising uppercut of the up elbow uppercut. <laughs> that is my favorite knockout in that whole movie. It's like, bah, 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 bah. Bah! Tell it was one of them big bearded thick motherfuckers. Solid motherfuckers. Like you know you gotta hit him hard to knock him out. He definitely won that first round. I remember that. Watch out for the rib. Uh. Hitting them with them fierce punches. Woo! Yeah, he's gonna lose this round. <laughs> He's beating the fuck out of Tilla. Shit to say. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> I remember my mom was crying in this movie because remember when they took him away, the little girl was just like looking out the door waiting for him and shit. <laughs> I popped her up. <laughs> Speaking of that, I can't wait for Street Fighter V. Out of all the games for PS4 that might be by PS4, that and Arkham Knight of uh, like probably a tie because Street Fighter Two is just my favorite fighting game of all time. Period. Man. If there was a game that obsessed me more than anything else, it was that. Like, if I was going to say the greatest game, my favorite game of all time, it's going to be Street Fighter 2. Period. I mean, I was just obsessed. And I was real good. Did nobody really fuck with me. I always wanted to be in a tournament to see how good I was. 
But now, I'm kind of like the fighter that's retired, you know? Like, uh, I remember there was this one guy um, that I grew up with that was uh, really good. He was all around good. Like, he was good in every single fighting game there was. He was just good. That ain't my thing, I specialized in Street Fighter. And I'll never forget it. Street Fighter Alpha was when he first challenged me. And I beat him. And he literally was looking at his controller like... He couldn't believe that I beat him. So he practiced like a few weeks. And uh, he challenged me again. I ended up beating him again. Like a few games. But he beat me one. He was like, yes! Yes! yes. Like he was so happy that he got me. And then after Street Fighter Alpha... I really stopped playing, and I remember uh, one day he challenged me in like, um, what was it like, it was like uh, Marvel Superheroes versus Capcom or something like that, and uh, he beat me, and you know, I, it didn't mean much to me. But I remember there was this other kid that lived another town over who challenged me, and uh, he brought his special controller, but I couldn't play with the system he wanted to play on. I think we were playing on PlayStation, but I always played on Sega Saturn. I mean, I'll show you Saturn, if y'all remember, had the controller built. It was just perfect for Street Fighter 2. We played it on both sets. I wore his ass out with my six-button controller. He couldn't do shit to me. He beat me one game with uh, his controller. And people was trying to, oh, he got, dog. He can't, he, no. Don't even try it, all right? I was wearing him out. A few games, and he beat me once, and y'all talking about it's a tie? Get the fuck out of here. But anyway, that was my little Street Fighter stories. Post your comments down below. Let me know what you think. If you enjoyed my reaction, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. If you didn't, you're not a Van Damme or Street Fighter fan. One million subscribers. Woo!